Hey what's up guys welcome to fine gap youtube channel and in today's video i am going to show you how you can design this type of shop page to your website friends i have used css grid system to make this page and video is going to be more important and before start please i request you to subscribe to our youtube channel to stay updated with amazing programming videos let's start so friends first of all you can see that i have created a simple html file with basic html structure and this is my style.css file here i have import a google font name montserrat and in the index.html i will use an external library font awesome so let's start and here inside my website images folder you can see that i have import four watch images all images have same size 500 pixel by 500 pixel so first of all open the view code studio and type here div dot main container div dot product image and give source images product one dot png you can see the output next type here div dot product this use h3 for title hw33 plus you can see the output next type here paragraph dollar 13.23 it will be the price of the product and next we have to create a div for rating so give class rating and type here span class fa fa star copy this one and paste this star five times you can see all the stars in the same line next let's just do the css part i have bring my output to the right side of my page so you can see the css so open style.css and i have already told you that this line is i am importing a google Google font name Montserrat. If you did not know how to import Google font, I have uploaded a video on my YouTube channel that how you can use Google fonts. You can watch the complete video. So now I have to type here star box sizing border box font family Montserrat padding zero and margin zero. Next you just have to copy this product class and type here dot product box shadow zero pixel seven pixel seven pixel and RGBA zero 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 and 0.1 this line will give a shadow to our card view i mean to the outside of the product and next you have to type here copy this main container paste here in the style.css and type here display grid gap 30 pixel and next type here grid template columns and type here auto four time basically this property will show you that how much columns you want to display to your user because i want to display four columns that's why i have used auto and if you want to give specific widths to your each column you can change these autos for example 100 pixel or whatever you want so next you have to type here body width 100 percent padding 120 pixel you can see the output and next you have to type here dot product img width 100 percent you can see the output you can see that basically it is displaying me itself at the half of the screen but suppose if i will copy this product tag and paste this four time and refresh my page you can see that my products are displayed in a decent way inside my page but first of all i will design my first product completely and then i will copy its code uh, eight times so next you have to type here copy this product des description open style.css paste this dot product description h3 only type product description and type here text align center yeah it's looking fine and next inside the product tag type here border radius 20 pixel and inside your image you can see that the bottom radius have been rounded but to rounded your upper radius you have to give a property to your image like border top radius border top right radius 20 pixel and border top left radius should be 20 pixel so actually the top right and left radius is also rounded if you want to see this just uh, change your box shadow from 0 pixel to 7 pixel so you can see that your top right and top left bottom border radius have also changed but let me turn this zero pixel copy product description and type here dot product h3 font size 24 pixel similarly just copy this and paste here and type here p font size should be 18 pixel next you have to create a class here check and give color orange and inside your span tag give a class check copy this and paste this three times so you can see that by doing this your first three stars will be orange and the second two stars will be black and next you have to type here in the product description class give padding 
bottom uh, not padding bottom but you can give padding 20 pixel and 0 pixel yeah it's looking fine give a padding to your heading 3 as well 10 pixel and 0 pixel that's it next i just have to copy this product and paste this eight times so just open index.html and copy this product and i'm going to first of all delete the remaining code and next just paste this product for eight times uh, it's seven times and next i have to paste this one time again so you can see that your products are displaying in a decent way to your user and next i just have to change these products like product two three four so basically i just have used these four watches images inside my image tag and friends you can see that this is our beautiful products page inside our website i don't have used bootstrap i just have used simple css grid system and there are three properties of css grid system only here the first one is display grid and the second one is grid template columns and the third one is 30 pixel gap it means that how much gap you want to give between your products the more you will increase the value this value the more gap you can see on your products so friends i hope you must enjoy this video and lecture was important because the students whose css is weak they face a lot of difficulty to align products horizontally but i hope you must understand that how to use css grid system to do that so please subscribe to our youtube channel and be and share this video with your those friends who want to learn web designing and please subscribe to our youtube channel to stay up to date with such type of videos and finally thanks for watching